Hey, how's it going, everybody? Uh, sorry, I haven't posted any videos lately. I've just been pretty busy at work. I leave before the sun comes up. Getting back when this when the sun's down. I'm definitely pretty busy. Um, but I have been running, but I just don't really have time to post videos. I'm in a, a taper taper period of my training schedule, which means um tapering down in mileage not running as much not running as hard just trying to <clears throat> keep the legs loose but trying to conserve them trying to rest them up for the upcoming marathon i officially signed up for my first marathon i'll be running the arizona rock and roll marathon uh, january 20th down in phoenix <clears throat> so you guys are there definitely support the runners if you guys are in the area um come out support me if you guys want uh, I greatly appreciate it and if you guys happen to be there and um, see me running definitely take some videos so that way i can put them on uh, one of my next videos one of my upcoming videos and uh, so yeah i definitely feel like i'm in sub three hour marathon pace this which i is which is what is the time that I need to qualify for the Boston Marathon. I definitely feel that I'm there. Um, so I just gotta go out there, run my race, run smart, um, and just let my training take over from there. Because I know I've been working towards this goal and working hard, and I definitely feel like I'm where I need to be. Um, so yeah, I'm just trying to figure out my racing strategy. Um, I know the paces I want to run. I need to run a 6.55 per average mile. But I'm thinking maybe the first 13.1 miles I'll go out um, at maybe a 7 minute pace. And after the halfway point, I'll try to pick it up. Definitely try to pick it up. Uh, maybe to a 645 average i looked at the elevation charts of the race pretty much the first half of the marathon looks like it's going uphill at a uh, gradual incline um i think it grows probably like two to three hundred feet in elevation which isn't much um and the last half of the race is downhill i think it drops that two to three hundred feet that you climb in the first half of the marathon um so definitely works as my, works to my advantage of that last 13.1 miles to run that 645 i need to um but yeah just try to stretch every day drink a lot of water um I'm trying to carb load this week um so yeah definitely if you guys are in the area and or you guys are running this weekend if you guys see me definitely come by and say hi we can swap some race stories and i definitely like to see you guys out there if you guys are out there um like i said if you guys see me come say hi and um yeah thank you guys um so i'll see if i can post more videos this week um like i said i'm in the taper week so i think i'm gonna run probably about 20 miles this week not much and like I said, just try to keep the legs loose and try to go into the race with peak performance. Um, I know it's going to be tough, but I think I can do it. I think I'll get that sub three hour marathon. And if you guys want to see how I'm doing during the race, I'll see if I can find the link where it shows. I think it shows every three miles uh every three miles of the race where i cross and give you a, give you guys a little update so if you guys want that i'll post it in one of my videos this week um thank you guys and i'll see you guys hopefully this week on my next video thank you guys mm -hmm.